Langley, BC, as your Vancouver Giants are getting set to take on the Tri-City Americans in just a second here. Giants, of course, will skate left to right here on home ice for this uh, first period in their white home jerseys, taking on the Americans in their navy road jerseys with white and red trim. They got a power play that uh, yesterday did not score and did not look that organized. We'll see if they can change things up a little bit here. Roberts, they win the faceoff to Schmidt from the right circle. A shot stopped by Kelsey. Still 117 remaining on the man advantage. Schmidt weaving his way through to his right for Alberta. Tried to drop it for Roberts. Roberts then tripped on the linesman. And Parker Bell is going to have a shorthanded breakaway. Bell is into the backhand. Stopped by Hutchison. He closed the wickets. Bell tried to go five hole. And Hutchison said no. Cole cutting across. Couldn't quite get it. Tried to kick it up to his stick as the Americans take over. Cross ice pass and a low shot is stopped by Hutchison trying to get back in time. And I think he got a part of the blocker on that after it just snuck through and just rolled wide. Shot from the outside, kicked out again by Hutchison, rebound into the corner. For a second, it looked like he lost it, but he recovered. Now Tittleback will come into support and plays it along for Leslie. Leslie stops up at the far side boards in his own zone and he'll play it back behind for Wilson. Wilson fan on the pass as Sloan scores. A quick release. I don't think he even really aimed that puck he just let it go and it went top corner on the short side 21 seconds in the americans have struck first blood as subject trying to knock his man off the puck it'll come up to the top of the circle this drive from smith is blocked but held in by dragasevic now top of the circle mcmillan fires one scores short side over the glove the same side that sloan found the back of the net on and Tri-City has struck twice quickly. It's 2-0. It's kind of outside the crease, and he got the benefit of the doubt with the whistle. It's right off the faceoff. Freer walks out and scores. Drew Freer makes it a 3-0 Tri-City lead. Here we are, 335 into the second, and it's a deficit that is growing. Giants down 3-0 as Dragasevic stick handling his way through traffic. Right wing entry now, a pass right to the middle, and Cook scores. What a setup from Dragasevic, and Cash Cook has his first. He did get that face off, but up and out by Tri-City. Now smacked in from center by Justin Ivanusik. Looking forward is call, call in tight all alone, stopped by Kelsey. Merwald will shoot it along the dasher. He's got Haliburta with Lipinski ahead of him. He feeds it up. It's a two-on-one for the Giants. Short-handed, three-on-one. Lipinski for Hammond. He shoots and scores! Logan Hammond with a short-handed goal on a three-on-one. Gets the Giants on the board. It's now 4-1, 9.32 to go in the third. Giants down 4-1. They still have to kill the remainder of this penalty off. Another minute and seven seconds. Gavin from the top of the circle. Across one-timer, scores! Parker Bell with a blast on the one-timer. Not a one-timer slap shot, just a one-timer snapshot. It had a lot of velocity, and it's 5-1 Tri-City. When it hit a body in, in the corner now. Peters intercepted for a second by Halliburton. Now nice move from Cole, who got to the middle. Stop, rebound, scores! Ivan Usyk on the doorstep, puts it home. And it's a 5-2 game with 4-4. 58 to go in the third. McMillan, stick handling along the outside, try to drop feed, picked off by Tyler Thorpe. Thorpe chugging down the right wing, drop feed in a good one for Tittleback, it's a two on one down low, pass across, big save from Kelsey, robs Haliburta. That was set up perfectly from the Giants, and that will do it. As the final buzzer goes. Final score here at the LEC, Tri-City takes this one 5-2 to two over your Vancouver Giants. Four goals in the second for Tri-City was enough.